Love After Lockup star Josh Hyatt has a true supporter in Cheryl, his lady love. She has expressed how proud she is of him according to Starcasm. When asked if she would worry he'd steal from her, she said, if he's really desperate. She went on to say he doesn't steal from people he loves, just people who deserve it. Cheryl said, no, he's stolen from the community. He's stolen from drug dealers. She told her sister she's looking for a Bonnie and Clyde tight relationship. It's unclear if she knows how their relationship actually ended. Her sister is skeptical about the relationship, and Cheryl tells her she's making a big deal out of nothing. Her sister responds, he robbed a bank. After being arrested for bank robbery in 2013, his gun was tied to lots of other crimes. It seems he's robbed from more than just banks. Cheryl found Josh when she was doing research on serial killers for a book report according to Hollywood Life. It seems he doesn't just steal from people who deserve it, but also from his co-workers, friends, and neighbors. A press release from the police states he was also guilty of robbing the Little Caesars he worked for and the mobile home park he lived in. Josh Hyatt certainly keeps it close to home. In addition to these crimes, he also stole cars and more than likely other things he didn't get caught for. Cheryl talked about the heist in the love after lockup premiere. She said Josh Hyatt wore a long blonde wig when he robbed the bank. It's clear he didn't think the people in his community thought he was capable of a crime. When someone robs a bank close to home, people could maybe see the person thinking they'll get away with it. When someone also robs the place they live, then there's a bit of a disconnect. As if this whole relationship isn't crazy enough, Cheryl also has a friend Tony the Clown who weighs in on the relationship in full costume. He said he's a failed bank robber, a failed Little Caesars robber, a failed car thief, and a failed neighboring mobile home burglar. Tony the Clown seems to have it all figured out. Josh Hyatt is up for parole soon, and they can start their fairy tale life of crime together. The reality television series Love After Lockup has introduced viewers to a diverse array of individuals who have experienced the ups and downs of romantic relationships with partners who are incarcerated. One of the most memorable stars of the show has been Josh Hyatt, a figure whose criminal history made him infamous. However, it turns out that Josh Hyatt isn't just bad at bank robbing. His tumultuous life journey is a captivating story of resilience, redemption, and personal transformation. Josh Hyatt first appeared on Love After Lockup as an ex-convict with a criminal record that included bank robbery. While his past actions were undoubtedly controversial, they also served as a stark backdrop for the compelling transformation he would undergo throughout the series. During his time on the show, Josh developed a relationship with Courtney, who was his pen pal while he was incarcerated. Viewers watched as their love story unfolded, witnessing the challenges of reintegration into society and the complexities of navigating a romantic relationship with such a background. Josh's struggles with employment, securing housing, and maintaining stability outside of prison were laid bare for all to see. As Josh's life unfolded on screen, it was clear that he faced many challenges in his journey toward redemption. However, he wasn't just bad at bank robbing. He was also struggling to overcome the internal and external obstacles that came his way. Despite the odds stacked against him, Josh Hyatt's story became one of redemption and self-improvement. He showed a sincere commitment to rebuilding his life and making amends for his past actions. His dedication to Courtney and her son, whom he considered his own, demonstrated a genuine desire to provide a stable and loving environment for his new family. Beyond his relationship with Courtney, Josh sought to make amends with his family and reconnect with them after years of estrangement. He expressed remorse for the pain he had caused and made efforts to rebuild those bonds. This journey of reconciliation endeared him to many viewers, who saw him as a man determined to turn his life around. In a genre often criticized for its sensationalism and dramatic conflicts, Josh's story offered a refreshing and authentic perspective. It reminded viewers that redemption and personal transformation are possible, even for those who have made serious mistakes in the past. 
The real story of Josh Hayat is one of personal growth, healing, and the power of love. His journey from a life of crime to a committed partner, a loving father figure, and a family member working towards reconciliation resonated with viewers and offered hope that positive change is possible, even after a criminal past.